This weekend, Celebrity Edge will be the first cruise ship to sail out of a U.S. port since the entire industry was shut down in March of 2020, which is why guests on that sailing were concerned when the ship was coded red by the CDC early Wednesday morning. Generally speaking, that means that someone on board has tested positive for COVID. However, Celebrity explained that during testing last week, one of the 900 crew members on board did test positive. And in a statement, Celebrity said that crew member has since been moved off the ship and all the crew have been retested negative. The ship is scheduled to depart Port Everglades at 7 p.m. on Saturday evening. And Norwegian Cruise Line has canceled cruises on five more ships, saying that the decision was, quote, in support of our phased return to service. The following voyages have been canceled. Pride of America through November 20th, Norwegian Dawn through November 21st, Joy through November 13th, Sky through January 21st, and Star through January 2nd. Additionally, earlier this month, the line announced that Norwegian sky bookings from September 5th to October 10th will be moved to a different itinerary aboard Norwegian Gym as an equipment swap. And Carnival Corporation announced on Wednesday that eight of its cruise lines have plans to restart a total of 42 ships in 2021. Its 2021 restart represents 52% of the company's total capacity across its global fleet of 91 ships. You can read all about eight of the cruise line's restart plans at cruiseradio.net. And cruise line stocks were essentially flat on Wednesday. Carnival Corporation 28.15, Norwegian 31.00, and Royal 86.16. Breaking news and up-to-the-minute industry coverage at cruiseradio.net. I'm Doug Parker with Cruise News Today. Cruise News Today is a production of Cruise Radio. For daily updates, subscribe to the Cruise Radio YouTube channel or visit cruiseradio.net.